slingshot practice number one. Okay, so we're standing at a pretty cold thing. Oh, jeez. It's cold out here. It's kind of not a good day, but... Can. Cans are, like, somewhere in there. Up in that tree right there. Down there. And where's the other one? Okay, so there's one up there. The tree. It's like these white specks. I don't know and then there's a rusty one that matches the tree, so. Thank you. Knock the snow off. And now a tutorial on JB Studios. How to do a slingshot. Now, probably did it in the last video. Should be quite simple. You have clutch shot, steel shot, any type of shot that you can, lead shot. You stick in the pouch, don't pinch in front of, like I said in the last video, don't pinch in front, pinch on the pouch. Make sure your bands are a Y. And look down the bands at your target. I hold my pointer finger at my mouth, and my thumb at my um, my nose, and I come in here, take out, so I have a clean shot. I missed that, but hold on. Oh, yeah, you can. Oh, jeez, no, freezing. And aim right to all of it, but shooting left. Oh. Most, I don't really do this, but take your time. Take your time as long as you want. Line right up and shoot the can. Where are these things going? All right, we'll do a few more shots and then we can have some fun with some other things. Alright, I got a few more ammo left in my pocket. Boom! Man, these branches are skinny. Alright, let's go have some fun. the next day yep this hat looks makes me look it's pulling up my head 
Is that better? Yes, that's better. Oh, my head. Alright, so... Today... Oh, wait, it's the same... It, oh, my word, I keep doing this again. Did that in the last video, but... We're doing a bug out bag. Stay tuned, and you'll know how to do it. Alright, so this is all in that, this bug out bag. Um, it's everything in the camera. I hope it is. If it's not, I'm sorry. BBs for some steel shot for slingshot. More steel shot. A first aid kit. Oh, jeez. Wait. No. Uh, 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 okay. No. A tiny container shroud kit with a compass at the top. That works pretty good. Then we have a fire striker. Just take it like that. And it lights a spark. This is our claws, like, you don't know when you can use claws, you know. I don't know if you guys know about this, this guy, but this is a yo-yo. Not a toy yo-yo. It's actually for fishing. So whenever you put this on your line, and you set it to a setting right there, and whenever you feel a tug, Let's go and spring the sis back. Then, next up, we have a emergency tent. Wet line. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Emergency tent. I think it collects like, yeah, 90% of your body heat. We got a raincoat. This is, I printed off a outdoor survival guide. It's a pocket. Next up is the Sparrow Slingshot. Obviously, you guys seen that. You guys seen that in almost every video. Clay shot right here. Um, filtrated drinking straw. Some bank line. A tent. Life tent. A cup. This is weird, but it's actually a foldable cup. Met for survival. But yeah. And then all you have to do is collapse it, stick this thing on top, and stick it right back. I mean, it can hold coffee, basically anything. Then, next up, we got our binoculars. Minocular, not binocular. Then, in the front pouch, we have our fishing stuff like meters. Jig heads, flies, anything you can think of that. Then over here is our first aid kit. We got a compass, a survival card in there, another survival fowler's maker and mischief survival card, a saw, hooks, band-aids, drug, like the dr alcohol stuff that you put on there. Then it is then next up is a uh, Leatherman Rev. Oh, jeez. Um, this is a really good tool for survival. So, step back. Oh! I always have a problem putting these guys back. I don't like putting these guys back. So, you put that back. And the top, you... Oh, yeah. There's... I cannot get that one out, but it's a... Another knife. This is more likely my junk knife, but I use that for like cooking and stuff. Pops back in there. Then we have our Morak knife. Or Mora knife. Not Morak, oh my word. Mora. We have an arrowhead saw, which I don't really know what. The point is, for, ugh, the point is for that. But then you, uh, for this, you light your fire, and you can go up here. 
and it gives it more air, more oxygen to breathe. Then it's one of these thingamajiggy clips. You clip basically anything to it. Um, this up here. What is glue? Oh, this. This in here is flashlight. Uh, knife. little tiny Swiss Army knife and this is an outplant <laughs> no joking a uh, little ferro rod and full of these from my very first video of <laughs> starting a fire Jaden's one take if you guys haven't seen that go check that out quality's kind of bad but I mean it's my first video um then it's like you break it up and start a fire so Oh yeah, and the hatchet. Pretty sharp. Alright. Yep, I will see you putting it together. tour on the inside. You got the hook on the outside, hatchet, knife in the back. That's what it looks like on the inside. Tent up here, all the stuff, over 30 items. We got back, but yeah. Personally, I had a, my most favorite thing is this, actually, because it's very useful. There's lots of stuff that you could use. Anyways, what I was saying was this was my favorite because it's good, useful for survival kit. Yeah, it was the camera up there somewhere. Oh, my dad was talking through. So we are going. Ugh. Sometime we're gonna do a catch and cook with this, or like spending overnight down at the woods, down at my creek. Oh my word, what is going on here? There. Boom. Yeah. There it is. So, I will see you guys on the next video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video one. Video one? What? I'm at one. So. Yeah, subscribe, like, comment down below if you have any questions about this video or ideas for a video. So, see ya. One trigger shenanigans out. Oh, come on. <sighs> mm hmm Yep. Alright, so, it's the next day.